Ryan. What's your favorite on Days of Our Lives? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. We've got the president of the fan club back there. <laughs> Just somebody back there. Who would like to see Patch and Kayla get together? Yeah. Well, tell you what. I suppose you're ready to meet him, right? Yeah. Let's welcome Stephen Nichols. Let's go up just a little bit closer to them, all right? Oh. <laughs> hey, well, I, I gotta ask you, Steve. Are you and Kayla ever gonna get together? Well, I certainly hope so. Yeah. <laughs> Could you stand a real-life relationship like that? No. <laughs> no, I couldn't. It'd I, be I, awfully tough. No. Though. Yeah, they drag it on a little too long, I think. Yeah, yeah, I could be. Well, I'll tell you what, I bet you a lot of folks out there would like to talk to you. The number to call here is 578-0707, 578-0707. You want to talk to Patch? We got a terrific show coming up for you next here on AM Cleveland. Don't go away. Scott will be right back with Stephen Nichols of Days of Our Lives. Soap expert Linda Hirsch will continue our health and fitness shape-up program and do's and don'ts for moms. All coming up next on AM Cleveland. Rice side dishes, noodle and pasta too. He's one of daytime's biggest heartthrobs, Patch from Days of Our Lives. Soap star Stephen Nichols joins us live today on AM Cleveland. questions about your favorite soap. We've got some do's and don'ts for mothers, and we're going to continue our physical asset series for you. Right now, here's the host of AM Cleveland, Scott Newell. Thanks, Cam. Good morning. Oh, what a group. What a bunch. <laughs> well, Pat's going to be here in just a second, but I want to, first of all, before we get started here, I want to say thanks to the Browns because they gave us one terrific year. I don't care what anybody says, the Browns are still the greatest, huh? I know, I don't think there's one person in this room who did not watch yesterday and it was a terrific game we were proud to have had it here right here on channel three and of course bernie and the boys are going next year right all the way to the Super Bowl. so thanks again to the browns and uh, we're going to try to talk to a couple of them later on in the week here so uh, anyway let's get back down to business here and before we meet stephen nichols live again let's take a look at a scene from days of our lives all right let's take a look at a scene from the show James. didn't i tell you that this was going to happen sooner or later didn't i Go with me. And what about your mom and your little brothers and all them? Didn't they tell you too? Didn't they tell you? Well, maybe you the I should have listened to them. Yeah, that. maybe you should have. Well, I did it. Because I listened to my heart. Well, it looks like your heart played a real nasty trick on you, Kayla. I never lied to you about who I was. Never once. In fact, I tried to protect you. I told you to stay away from me. I told you to give up that beauty and the beast fantasy that you've been carrying all along, but you wouldn't listen. I know all about that side of you. Then what are we talking about here, Kayla? I thought I was different. 
different. I thought that you wouldn't do those things to me. I didn't know you then. I think they like you. <laughs> yeah, I guess they do. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't. I think a lot of people don't realize that when you first started on the show, as I understand it, your your character is supposed to die off pretty quickly. What made the producers decide to keep you on? <laughs> Just my looks. <laughs> Give me a little more credit than that. <laughs> no. Um, well, they just liked the chemistry that the other actors and myself had, and. They, li they saw a possibility for a storyline for this character. They thought, you know, he was intriguing, and they decided to try to write a story. And that's what happened. You and Kayla, what kind of a chemistry do you have off screen? We're the best of friends. She's so, she's just a wonderful person, and we are really good friends. Is it difficult? Now, I notice you don't have the patch on today, obviously, because there's, uh, that's obviously just for the show. Yeah. Is it difficult after you've been working all day? Does your vision, you know, after having the one, the one eye shut for the whole day is that well, difficult yeah. to adjust to well when i take the patch off if, if i rem remember to take it off my uh right eye is blurred for for about 15 minutes but i've been to the eye doctor and rest assured everybody i have, I have 20 20 vision it hasn't <laughs> that is terrific it's so good to have you here yeah well you can they'll applaud at anything huh? thank you, thank you. This is a terrific bunch. I want to, yeah. <laughs> Let's go to the telephone. Hi, you're on with Stephen. Hi, Scott. Hi. Hi, Stephen. Oh, I just love you so much. I wanted you for Christmas, but it just didn't work out. <laughs> but my question is, um, are you going to be a um, suspect um, in Emma's shooting? And if uh, who is the girl following you? Well, I don't know who that girl is following me, but she sure is irritating. You. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not involved in that storyline, the uh, the shooting. No. I hope I find the baby, though, before he gets to school. <laughs> when are they going to find that baby, anyway? Do you know? Do you have any idea? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I got a letter the other day, and I always say this now because I thought it was so funny. She said, if they don't find that baby soon, it'll be in school by the time they do. <laughs> Yeah. Be through medical school and be a doctor by the sure. time. That's right. Hi. Patch, I mean Steve, uh, we love your character and it's so witty. Do you ad lib your lines or are they all written for you? Well, I ad lib a lot. You know, they write, when they write a joke, sometimes they write it in, inappropriately. They write it where it doesn't belong. And sometimes I take it out, sometimes I put one in, sometimes I change it. <laughs> yes. Um, Steve, do you think that Patch will ever get an eye on Days of Our Lives? Yeah. 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 Get an eye. I already have one. No, I, I really uh, sincerely hope that never happens. I think that it would be best for the character to stay with the patch. Yeah, okay, you're in agreement. We've got lots of questions. We've got to take a break right now, but we're going to ask a people poll question about you, all right? This is the folks at home are going to get a chance to see maybe if they'd like to write the show, okay? Oh, great. So let's check it out here, all right? Our people poll question today, Stephen, we'll be back. Pat, should A, get together with Kayla, B, stay a loner or stay available, as it were, or C, find somebody else, a new love? 5780013, let us know what you think Pat should do. And we'll be right back with more. <laughs>